making a spaghetti squash spaghetti and there is a close-up on how it looks this right here is my spaghetti squash I already have my oven preheating to 400 degrees and when I chop up the spaghetti squash in half I'm actually going to be placing some black pepper some Italian seasoning some Himalayan pink sea salt and also some avocado oil on the squash and I'm going to be putting it in my pan for about 40 minutes so it will cook very evenly let's go ahead and chop off the ends of this spaghetti squash And then I have to cut it in half. This is what it looks like cut in half. And then I'm just going to take my knife and get all of this stuff out. Okay, so I think this is actually good enough. So there we go. And I'm going to put these two on a pan. Let me move this stuff out the way. Okay. So what we're going to do now is drizzle a little bit of the avocado oil onto the spaghetti squash and then we're going to rub it in And then I'm going to go ahead and sprinkle some salt and pepper all over it. Okay, and then I'm going to put some of my Italian seasoning on it. This is coming out real slow, you guys. So, here we go. So, this is how it's looking right now and then here's the other one and i'm gonna go ahead and place these in the oven for about 40 to 60 minutes okay so i just took my spaghetti squash out of the oven and it cooked for about 40 minutes and this is how it's looking right here i'm gonna go ahead and flip it over so you guys can see that's how it's looking right there and it's nice and golden brown 
I'm gonna stick a fork in it to kind of show you guys what see how it's nasty. be quiet Millie that was my daughter you see how it's kind of like looking like spaghetti noodles so that is what you guys want so I'm gonna flip it back over and let it cool down okay so I got it flipped over and I'm actually gonna be defrosting some of this ground turkey here's all the seasonings that I'm using with my ground turkey gourmet burger seasoning lori seasoning salt black pepper burger seasoning mushroom swiss and garlic powder okay so i have my spaghetti squash over here underneath the foil to keep warm i have my ground turkey in the pan and i'm gonna go ahead and season up the ground turkey spaghetti sauce that I will be using I got the Prego no sugar added the traditional kind I usually get the traditional with the sugar and the brand by Prego but this time I am trying to be super healthy in this dish so I'm gonna go ahead and add it to the meat it's browning up very nicely over there so I'm getting ready to go ahead and add this to the ground turkey spaghetti squash I'm getting ready to just dig that out like that and y'all see how it turned into the spaghetti like noodles and this is just very very healthy I don't feel any guilt eating this and this is gonna be so yummy and all I'm doing is just scooping it out like this. Make sure you get all of that vegetable goodness on your plate. And all along the edges so you can get all that seasoning and it's just like so cool that this has a very noodle like consistency I just think that's very awesome I think I'm gonna be making sp this spaghetti squash all the time because it's very low in calories and it's also very flavorful I actually tasted some not too long ago before I actually played at this mm -hmm. so let's go ahead and get our spaghetti sauce with our ground turkey place that on top And this spaghetti sauce turned out really good as well. And if you're feeling dangerous, go ahead and add some Parmesan cheese. So 
Here is the finished dish. Please give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button on your way out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.